I think the default is heart steel. I think I'm gonna grab heart steel. Got a little scary. I thought <clears throat> thought maybe the Zed could throw a shuriken at me. Um, okay, a Lowie matchup is a little tough. I'd say it's one of his, like, three top worst matchups. <clears throat> now that I think about it, actually. Um, you do win level one. Grasp here. I got Grasp back up. You do win level one, but um, maybe I should have taken E. Maybe that would have been better. Do a little bit more damage. Yes, I go flash into Alawi specifically. Yes. Um, Alawi's got a pretty big slow. If she land, if she steals your spirit, so I want to. Get flash so I can dodge uh, a tentacle slap while she's in ult. I think it's necessary. I take flash into scary matchups basically. <clears throat> okay, she, she, wow, she's still got two corrupting pot charges left. So it's Lowy. Just like playing against Mundo, you want to stand behind your minions, make sure that she can't hit you with her E. She loses all pressure when she dodge it. Super low right now. Oh! <laughs> Oh boy. What's going on here? What's going on here? Okay, if we walk side to side, it makes it harder for her to hit us. Stand behind the creeps. Easy. Trade there. Burst combo, which is uh, Q auto E. <clears throat> Kindred is dead. We know her E is down, so we're just gonna push this all the way. these so she doesn't get free free pressure wow this amumu is going crazy dude <coughs> excuse me
Make sure after you trade with an auto, you you step back to use aggro on the creeps. Very very important. Don't want to take any free damage. Very smart of this Mumu, by the way, to gank pre six, and then I hope he doesn't gank further because we lose if he does. So she's <clears throat> so with a Lowie, I play a Lowie as well. Um, with a Lowie, and anybody who's got like a skill shot, that's very important. You hit the skill shot, like Lux, um, you know, Morgana. <coughs> Excuse me. It's very important that you create a situation. Create a situation in which you're gonna hit your ability. You can't just throw it and, and hope to hit because at higher elo, everybody's good at dodging. Which means that you can't depend on your skill to hit a skill shot. You've gotta, you know, you push them against a the wall, you wait for them to go for a minion, um, you predict, but that's a little harder. You uh, chain CC with an ally, that kind of stuff. There's gotta be a little bit of extra oomph in order to make you. Okay, we see Jungler is bot. Oh, he doesn't have TP, so I'm gonna take the plate here. I would like to help. Um, so we got a kill. I'm gonna go straight into a hard steal after my Danny's. Yeah, and th like these items that hard steal builds from are really good. It's just like pure HP, you know, and that's gonna give you that's gonna be pure damage, damage and durability. Like I'm already pretty tanky. Over 200, only over 2,000 health. She's only at 1,000. Isn't that insane? Ooh, time. Damn is, I can clear pretty quick. They just happen to all be there. <clears throat> Wish Mumu had showed up to that fight. I just went Reju, Bead, and Refill first start. Sustain and build Mythic faster. Interesting. Wait, Refill, Reju. Oh. That actually does not sound very good, I'm not gonna lie. <clears throat> Let's see what Doran's gives you. 80 HP. Regen. And more regen. I think Doran's is better. Glitch. 
We'll see if she TPs here to catch a wave. Okay, I think we're doing pretty good. We're scaling here. She's trying to find a situation where she can land E on me. <clears throat> Makes you heal like Garen. Does it really? I feel like Dorance is, is more effective HP. Because like it doesn't matter how much you heal if you have low HP in the first place. Which, do which you know, Rejuve. Read your refillable, does not give you any HP. Yeah, well, you do get healing from Dorans. And starting Ruby is definitely not good because you don't get any regen at all. <clears throat> like with, Dor so Dorans is what we call a uh, combat item. You can you can one v one your laner. You can avoid gank stuff like that. You can uh, avoid dying from ganks rather. You heal back from poke really well. I like to see the the stats, but I don't think that rejuve refillable gives you as much healing as Doran's does. <laughs> She's tried so hard to hit me with that. It's a 300 gold component, you know. Doran's is super strong. Like, Doran's is really strong. You can't trust me. Also, uh, just curious. Uh, Try Edge. What's your, uh, what's your elo? You said you play Mundo in the jungle? Is that right? Or is it, uh, or are you a laner? Dorans, you gotta hear it first. So what, dude? You're getting hurt all the time. It's leak. You're getting emotionally hurt. Oh, trying things out is totally good. And you know what else is totally good? Me telling you that your ideas are only okay. Silver. She's got... <clears throat> I can't fight her now. She's got healing. Once you got any kind of healing... Um, Mundo can't really do anything. I'm hoping that she sees me and she tries to step forward and... Up out there. Keep. Mm -hmm. Oh, he gets her. Also, that Kindred didn't ult. <laughs> Very sad. Alrighty.
the, the, so theory crafting in League is fun. Um, mad man. The one thing I would say is if you're actually if you're trying to climb, just copy what people are already doing. Like, <coughs> there's already people who are higher rank than you who have been playtesting and theory crafting way more than you have. Doesn't mean you can't theory craft at all, but but it's very very beneficial <clears throat> to trust you know higher elo players because they were also silver. It's not like they're in you know they're in whatever master or whatever, and they have no idea what it's like down in silver. They were they were in silver. They know, you know they know. Can I hit that back off here. You hit her with cleavers. <laughs> what is that? What is this kindred doing? <coughs> Excuse me. My goodness. Oh, you don't do ranked? Gotcha. Gotcha. No worries then. Yeah, no worries. If you don't do ranked, dude, I'd fucking go Phantom Dancer. Not even joking. I think Phantom Dancer on Mundo could be crazy. No, it's not. It's literally not. Phantom Dancer? <clears throat> Mundo, Mundo can actually uniquely benefit from attack speed because of his E. So if you go lethal tempo, and then you probably are going to want to go tank for a bit, and then Phantom Dancer, like, later on. Um, he does some crazy damage. Like, when you're fed, I think Phantom Dancer is, is not troll at all. Lethal tempo Phantom Dancer. Though it was much better with Old Mundo. Old Mundo did a lot more damage. Let's go. Um, no. I, I think Reju refill is, is bad. I think it's really, really bad. Not gonna lie. I think giving up Dorans is troll. <clears throat> and uh, that thing you mentioned where like the new good build was built by a gold elo player. That's exceedingly rare, first of all. Oh, the FF. Um, not only is it exceedingly rare, it's like um, higher elo players probably figured it out at the same time, right? It's not like everybody was like, oh, this gold player did it. That means it must be good. It was because they theory tested it as well separately. <clears throat> 